All right, hey, Josh here, Attica Lumber Company, actually out here in Seneca County again. In this video, I wanna share with you why we do our porches a little bit different, our mono porch is a little bit different. On this video, or actually on this building right here, 24 by 48, 14 feet tall. Now on this porch, we're doing a six feet, 10 inch. All right, section right here on this mono porch. Let me share with you right here. So we walk right there. And the reason why we do that, we're maximizing the sheet of metal. Now this customer wanted six feet. We said, you know, let's do six feet, 10 inch. And that way, you know, we don't have to cut a sheet of metal so we can go out there and we can use three sheets of metal there. All right, so make that flush. So something to consider there. Again, not a huge thing, but a thing that, you know, give you 10 inches, a little bit more width on your porch. And then also you maximize the use of metal. So we like to do the 10 inch thing. All right, so again, 24 by 48. And let me turn this thing down. All right, maybe not, but anyway. But you can see what we're doing here, four by three windows, kind of gives you some perspective here, size wise, all right. So 24 by 48, 14, and then on this button we use four by six. You can see as the intermediate, six by six corner post. So a lot of these videos you've seen three ply laminated columns, but again, the strength right here is right there on the corner. So that's why we put the six by six right there. And again, two by 10, again, number one grade, skirt board right there all right and again the treatment process have improved again wood will rot eventually anything will rot over time but treatment process have really improved significantly so we haven't had too many issues with that hardly any issues with that and i know some of you find that hard to believe there but uh, that kind of gives you an idea there and then our trusses here again four foot on center Again, we don't do eight foot, nine foot, 10 foot on center, but four foot on center, you can see we got the hurricane ties braced up there. All right, and the reason why is you can see right there, see how the purlins are laying flat. Again, as a builder, when the builders put on the metal on this application, a lot easier to walk on purlins that are flat than if you put a, you know, if you put your trusses eight foot, nine foot, 10 foot, 11, 12 foot on center, uh, they're gonna be on edge and very, you know, it's tougher. But also it's tougher to nail something, when, you know, on edge. Um, you know, there's more likelihood of you not hitting that board and that screw coming through. So, and again, we have to set up, this guy's not gonna have the interior liner package, but you can see how we box that in and make that flush with the four by six. Two by six is boxing that window in. Okay, and you can see the double top beam header on this door. All right, so kind of give you an idea there. And uh, again, comments are always welcome. The next one, keep it locked loaded right here. Attica Lumber, Attica Lumber since 1925.